drop a like in the next five seconds because we have finally got the x force deadpool skin for ourselves that is right watch this video to know how to get it also guys let me remind you i'm gifting skins from the item shop that is right so go ahead and choose the skins that you want from the item shop and i'm hooking my subscribers out with any skins that you guys choose from so five subscribers every single day that i will be gifting out it can be a starter pack it can be a bundle it can even be the deadpool bundle or the new raven pool and cuddle pool bundle as well so go ahead and choose what you guys want and it could even be a battle pass as well so i'll be giving out battle passes to you guys if you don't have anything so go ahead and subscribe to the channel with all notifications turned on all notifications because you could be our 500,000 subscribers to subscribe right now and use the supporter creator code tamar shapira in the fortnite item shop use the code right now because when you guys use the code i'm able to do so many giveaways to you guys if you guys want skins then go ahead and use code tamal shapira in the fortnite item shop if you guys are using the code i'm gonna give your comment a heart so let me know in the comment section down below as you guys all know that today the x-force deadpool skin just got released and we have it for ourselves that is right and in this video i'm gonna tell you guys how you guys will be able to get the x-force deadpool skin for yourself by completing secret task which will be available to you guys in the game before we go any further let me know in the comment section if you guys will be choosing the normal deadpool skin or the x-force deadpool skin that you guys see over here put it in the comments and let's see which deadpool is going to win and, and we will also be able to see the final deadpool event as well to get started off just follow exactly what i do so basically then go to into your battle pass hq section and then go head over to the computer and check what the week one tasks were now for that we had to click on this object right over here and once you clicked on it then we were able to complete the week one tasks which were available for ourselves and we went ahead and we collected the final reward which was this go into your locker and check it do you guys have it or not well then we went back into the computer again to check our week two task which was like you know very simple all we had to do like click on this object right over here on top of this place and then we collected the task and once we did were done with that we went ahead for the second task now for the second task you need to check on the computer back again and then come back into the main hq itself now over here you will be able to see your first object underneath the table the second object will be located at boots hq so go ahead and click on it very simple and easy the third object will be located right over here on maya's base and this will be the reward do you guys have it check your fortnite locker right now and confirm it if you have it or not then go back into the computer back again and you guys will be able to see another set of tasks now these tasks will be different as well now for these tasks you need to go ahead and come right over here and then click on the object which is on the yellow wall once you click on it your task is done they need to come over here at pleasant park retail row or any poi where you guys can find toilets and you gotta go ahead and destroy the toilets which will be located inside the game very easy and simple task to complete and once you guys complete the task for for that particular week you will be rewarded with this item do you guys have it check your locker right now and then we were over here in this particular week where we had to complete the next set of tasks for this one you need to click on the object which is over here on the mirror and once you guys have done that we need to head over to the other place for that get back out of the office head towards maya's room and over there you guys will be able to see the armory and the second object will be located right over there very simple task to complete and the final reward will be this do you guys have it then check it in your fortnite locker then the next weekly task very very simple and very easy all you had to do like come over here and find the stuffed unicorn object now this is the object that you guys can find in Miasu's hq base for this one if you guys come over here on the left you guys will be able to see the stuffed unicorn located over here then to go inside the game and dance on different bridges which will be available so dance on every single bridge which is available to you guys we have red yellow blue purple and green and this is the reward do you guys have it next we need to go back into the computer and see these tasks for ourselves for this one we had to come over here at brutus hq now once you guys come over here now all these tasks will only be eligible for you guys will only be visible 
only if, if you have completed the previous weekly task. Now for this one, you need to come over here and click on the object which will be on the table and your task will be done. You need to get inside the game and go to these exact POIs. I'm just going to fast forward it because I, I, I just want to keep it short and simple. I've showed you guys all the location, which will be a necessity for you guys to complete all your tasks. Once you guys complete all your tasks, as you guys can see, you need to basically go into these named POIs where you guys will be able to see these posters on the wall. There will be ghost posters and shadow posters. And you gotta go ahead and deface it with the Deadpool logo. And once you guys do that, your task will be done and you will be rewarded on that particular week as well. Once you guys are done with that, then you gotta come over here and complete the next task for the next week. Now for this one, it was very simple and very easy. For this one, we need to go ahead and click on the object which will be found over here underneath the table. So go ahead and complete the task right now without any worries. So come over here into the Battle Pass HQ section. Once you guys are at the Battle Pass HQ section, you guys will be able to find these objects located over here. The first object will be located underneath the table next to Miyasu Kool's Nassau's feet. So go ahead and click on it and your task will be done. The next task will be inside the agents tab. So go to the agents, go into Miyasu's tab and then on the right side, on the very bottom, you guys will be able to see your next object. Click on it and your task for that particular week will be done. Once you guys are done with that, it is over, over and out, like super simple challenge, okay? Once you guys are done with that, we will be heading towards the next task for that particular week where you need to go to this exact PI. If you guys go back into the computer again, you guys will be able to see something like this. Then you gotta go ahead and enter the game and you gotta find any telephone booth that you guys can find at the agency or at the grotto, the shark, anywhere. So we chose this location because it was at the very center and uh, this was pretty safe. So we went ahead and we entered the telephone booth. If you guys don't know how to do that, then you guys gotta enter these porta potties that you will be able to see inside the game. Uh, I mean, I've also showed you guys the location in the game. This is next to Frenzy Farm. Go ahead and enter the uh, porta potties, and your task for that week will be done. Now, if you guys have completed all the tasks till now, you guys would definitely, if you guys have not skipped on any of these steps, you guys would definitely have the Deadpool skin for yourself. Now, these tasks were there till week 7. Now if you guys have already received the Deadpool and you guys do not have the further skin styles then you gotta go ahead and go back into the computer back again. Once you guys go back into the computer you guys will be able to see the task for the next week. So let's go ahead and check it. So these will be the task for the next week. So we went ahead and we checked the task. So for this one we need to go ahead and collect the pool floaty which will be located over here. Now to find the Pool floaty. It is very simple and easy. All you gotta do is need to head towards the agents tab, and over here, if you guys enter the skies agent HQ base, over there on the mattress on the carpet, you guys will be able to see the pool floaty located over there. So go ahead and click it and complete your challenge. The second challenge is that you need to head towards Deadpool's yacht, and you gotta dance at the dance floor. So that is a very simple challenge. So head towards the main deck, and over there, once you guys enter the door, you guys will be able to see the dance party happening over there so get onto the disco floor and start emoting and your challenge will be done then we entered the week 9 deadpool challenges to complete the challenge it is very easy so once you guys see the challenges you can can come over here at the battle pass section over here you guys will be able to find the shorts but just in case if you guys can't find it it will be located right over here so for this one you need to click over here in the deadpool to office once you guys click over here in the deadpool to office you guys will be able to see the shorts right over here next to the computer once you guys see over here next to these two stockings you guys will be able to see the shorts but just in case if the challenge doesn't count over here or doesn't even appear over here you guys will be able to find it in the agents tab the Brutus TNT and Miasso's Skies or even at the Midas HQ itself but although even if it doesn't appear over there there is another chance because I know another location of the shorts so join me as I take you over there so if the challenge doesn't count inside then you need to come over here into a real game and you need to head towards the Deadpool's yacht. It will be located right over here.
So once you guys are over here at the yard and you have transformed into a henchman so that you guys are safe, you need to exactly follow me as I'm taking you guys to that exact location just in case if the Deadpool shorts appear over here inside the game. So come right over here at the end of the yard. Once you guys come over here at the end of the yard, you guys will be able to see that there's this counter right over here. And next to these over here on the, on the table, you guys will be able to see Deadpool shorts also that can be found inside the game. So just in case if it doesn't appear in the battle pass section of your game, it might be located right over here as you guys can see that we have found an extra pair of short which is at the Deadpool's yard. So you guys can come over here and interact with it if we get the option to complete the challenge from here. Once you guys complete the challenge, you need to back. Now for the second part of the challenge, you need to start up a new game and you need to head towards Sweaty Sands to complete this task. So let me take you guys over there and show you guys how you guys can complete the second part of this task where you need to salute Deadpool's pants. That is right. So let's go ahead and show you guys the exact location so that you guys can go ahead and claim your X-Force Deadpool bundle. So once you guys are over here at the Sweaty Sands, all you gotta do is just follow me on the exact building that I'm landing right now. So over here at Sweaty Sands, the tallest building is, is going to be this one. So once you guys see the tallest building, you need to land over there. And you will be able to see Deadpool's pants just, just like this. Look at this. Look at this. We have finally found Deadpool's pants. Are you serious right now? So you gotta go ahead and use interact with this. So you need to co come over here and interact with the Deadpool's pants. So, so go ahead and you guys can, if you have the salute emote, you guys can go ahead and do it. If not, then you guys will get an option to interact with Deadpool's pants, which will be located right over here in Sweaty Sands. And if it doesn't count, you guys can come over to the yacht as well. And over here, you guys will be able to find Deadpool's pants swaying in the air as well. So it's pretty funny, but so you guys can go ahead and complete your task. So this will be the exact minimap location that you guys can find and the yacht. At the tip of the yacht, you guys will be able to find Deadpool's pants swinging in midair. And you guys will be able to interact with it and thus completing your challenge. And once you guys are done with the challenge, all you gotta do is just leave the game and, and get back into the main menu. And once you guys do that, lo and behold, you guys will be presented with the X-Force Deadpool skin. This is the new skin style that you guys will be able to receive for yourself. That is right. Go ahead and complete the task that I showed you guys here in this video. And once you guys do that, you guys will be able to claim this awesome skin for yourself. If you guys do not subscribe to the channel and do not turn on the notification bell, you guys won't be able to complete the challenge. So go ahead and subscribe right now for some good luck. And also guys, don't forget to drop a like and use code TAMASHABERA in the Fortnite item shop. Do it right now. What are you waiting for?